This is Game of Thrones-esque. I call him Bob the Crow. There he goes. So part of the acclimatization process is to walk higher than you sleep. And so we've done that and we found this fantastic crater. It's unbelievable. Uh, I think it was a side vent, but there you go. As the mist is coming in, as you can see, it's just really eerily beautiful. So hopefully we'll all sleep well tonight. Me and Ian, we're above the cloud line. It's quite impressive that, isn't it? Totally. Uh, and, deck. and today we're going to climb another 3,000 feet. Go above some more different Is it to clouds. Camp Horombe? Horomba. Horomba. Are we all ready, everyone? Yeah! yeah. yeah. Porters, are you ready? Are we all yeah. here? Very exciting, Josh. It is very exciting. We're, we're on our second leg. <laughs> uh, how are you feeling today? Because, you know, being the young buck of the group, um, <laughs> Slightly concerned for you that you might not have the energy to get up. Uh, I'm feeling all right. I'm yeah. feeling all right. Just, I'm, I'm just hoping I will. He's, he's, he's from Sparta. 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 Yes. What is the profession? It's funny. Sparta. It's funny. I, I'm, I'm terribly <laughs> mistaken. I thought he was from Hogwarts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So that bit on the right is Moenzi. Moenzi. And then the bit in between is the saddle that goes up towards Kibo. And Kibo is the name of the, the highest peak. Yeah. And the bit at the very top of the highest peak is right, the Thuru. I don't know if you can see that, but just above the cloud line, oh, the heather is starting to thin out. We are over 10,000 feet now. And we're gonna keep climbing to the Horombe huts. It's good stuff. Okay, so one of the things we have to do on Mount Kenya is you go up higher, your body needs water, your blood thickens. We're very fortunate to find this mountain stream and this is our water stop to fill up and this should get us to the next camp. Water is really important. If you're not taking four liters a day or thereabouts, then you run the risk of getting into trouble. So I have drunk three liters so far uh, and I've got another liter in my pack so I don't need to refill here, but it's poly poly to our final destination. No. We stopped for water on our way to our Rombo huts yeah. uh, in this beautiful little Woo! valley. Uh, yeah. And we're about an hour and a half away from 
from the huts possibly uh, and this is the first decent fresh water we've seen for it's funny actually I thought we would hours. see more fresh water yeah no we've not seen a great deal have we is it cold is it to it's taste it's nice and cold it's glacier I'm going to try some in a second lovely and cold um, the only problem is I'm a bit dubious about drinking it because curry went to toilet upstream I did not someone said to me that you went to toilet upstream <laughs> what you got oh, that was Tony that said that uh, <laughs> Tony we've made it to camp two we have yeah we're at what 11,900 plus feet. Or in metres, 3,721. I'm glad you got the metre part. Um, and the other cool thing is that we've walked for about six hours and we've come. Yeah, six, hours. six hours. and we've come 12k. 12.5, exactly as your book says. Yeah, not the signs, which so say 11. Don't believe the guides. Don't believe the signs or the guides. Yeah. They're wrong. Yeah, just read the wrong. book. Wrong. the book. Read the book that Tony's got. Yeah. So right behind us. <laughs> Is our home the next two nights? Yeah, lay, lay yeah. a tune down. Yeah, long as the sun comes shining, our love will keep on climbing with the visions here for you. And when the rain comes falling, you leave my nature calling you. Only you can see me through. <laughs> So, an end of another episode. As always, I want to thank you for watching. In the next episode, you'll see a rock that looks like a zebra. We'll see the saddle for the first time. And we start to get excited about summiting. As always, thank you for watching. Please rate and subscribe and do all of the things that YouTubers do. And click on one of the videos if you want to see what happens next or another adventure that I've been involved in.